Today we announce details of this year's winter plan. Our priority is to make sure that patients get the right care in the right place and at the right time throughout winter. This plan has a particular focus on making sure that patients are discharged in a timely way and that they receive the right services, whether that's home support services, step-down care, transitional care or long-term care. All of our hospital groups and CHOs have joint winter plans in place to prepare for and manage service pressures this winter. These plans are being managed by the winter action teams in each area. Whilst last year we focused on nine key sites across the country, this year our plan is extended across the whole of the country and the full population. We all need to prepare ourselves and our patients for winter. We know that this is the time of year when we will see the spread of respiratory infections, flu, winter vomiting bug and many other bugs and when winter weather affects people's health. It's important that people over the age of 50 who have a chronic condition such as asthma, COPD or diabetes know that they are more vulnerable to infection. They need to protect themselves this winter by getting the flu vaccine, checking in with their pharmacist or GP to ensure that they are taking their medication correctly and having their health monitored, and also making sure that they're aware of what services are available to them. I'm asking you all to please share the Winter Ready Checklist with your patients this winter to ensure that they and you are ready for the winter. Thank you.